Hi, uh, this is uh, our, our fourth video. In, in previous videos, uh, we, we already discussed about uh, CRM, a lot of, lot of things about CRM, uh, almost all the activities which we should perform uh, during the lead management. So now, uh, this is our fourth video and uh, we will understood uh, the further activities we should, which we should perform in the CRM. So let me uh, go inside the CRM app. Uh, this client uh, uh, already uh, scheduled for the demo and uh, I did demo today so I'm just going to mark this as the demo done now they want quotation okay so uh, I'm just going to schedule next over here uh, this will mark as done and schedule next will be the new activity uh, upload document okay schedule so and i will move this to, into uh, next stage presentation or uh, maybe uh, any the many stage so one stage will be uh, quotation preparation might be something like that so <coughs> now i open from here and uh, to Prepare a new quotation. Uh, you can see in, in opportunity only uh, you will find a new quotation button. Or uh, you can create quotation from uh, here also from the sales menu, my quotation, and then you will get a create button. But uh, my advice is always always create quotation uh, over the opportunity so that it it it, it will be linked. So for this particular opportunity, you already sent the quotation. So this will be linked. I will show you how. So new quotation. The moment I click on new quotation, all the information related to this particular uh, lead. So customer has filled by default expiration. So this quotation will expire on 31st uh, July. I just selected it, selected a date. Okay, payment term. So payment term will pick by default from the customer, but there was no payment term defined. That is why it is black. So let's say 45 days. I'm going to add a product, which product customer is interested for. So let's say, uh, Astral Shop is revenue selling monthly. Okay, this is a product which he is looking for. I will put a price. Let's say hundred dollar. I will put a tax. This this will again, again come by default if if tax is configured on the product. So it's all about the configuration, how you configure things, and system will <coughs> pick everything by default based on the configuration. And this the price list is GBP. Uh, why the price is this this this, this come this is coming uh, because on this customer this was the price list configured so this customer wants their invoices in the in this currency okay so uh, let me click uh, save and I just need to send this quotation I I want to send this quotation to customer so there's a button called send by email before doing that let me show you why I created quotation from uh, uh, opportunity. Because the moment I created a quotation from this button on the opportunity, you can see on this opportunity, there's a quotation smart button appear, right? So this will give you, give you a linking between quotation and the opportunity. So for this opportunity, you already sent uh, prepared one quotation. So I just click over, you can create multiple quotation, not an issue. Okay. And you can cancel the quotation as well. So you can revise the quotation, you can edit it, you can revise it. Okay. And just click send by email. Uh, so system will pick by default the default email address of the customer and if you want to I'm adding my email address also over here so that, so that I, I can show you how customer uh, can see the this email in their uh, inbox then how what customer can do from from their side so you just send the quotation by email to the customer and now you can uh, customer will get an email he will review the quotation he can sign the quotation, he, he can accept the quotation, he can sign the quotation and also he can pay online if you configure your payment 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 method and all. So customer can pay, even pay online. Even customer can ask further queries on this, this particular uh, quotation. So let me show you, show you how. So I already uh, configured this email. So you can see th th this is a quotation, uh, uh, brand lock quotation, this one. Uh, this is the email body so you can see uh, hello quotation number with reference to this is ready there's attachment 
if customer want to see the, in the PDF format, this is the this is the quotation in the PDF format. There is a button review, sign, and pay online quotation. So if customer click on this, if customer click on this, he will get a wait. Let me 